stuff like that. Uh, the sound from the mean from Kalaok and Boy thingy. <laughs> I basically stalked him. Like, no, like, shut up. Okay, I stalked my neighbor because he was playing random songs. And he played this song called Sabak. Sabak Daddy's whatever that song is. At fucking 7 a.m. in the morning. Who plays that song at 7 a.m. in the morning? Are you fucking insane? Or am I just being too fucking judgmental? But yeah, I stalk him. I was looking at him like from outside his window. And then his dog started barking at me. Don't mind my pimple. I know it's a little bit. His dog started barking at me. And I just ran away. And I went to my friend's house. And I realized it's 7 a.m. in the morning. And he's not awake at 7 a.m. in the morning. So I went back here again. And I just realized that my dog got out. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I know. Leave me alone, please. I'm trying to process everything what I just did. Anyways, don't mind that. <coughs> that was my yeah, yeah. Mm, yeah. Anyways, so I went back and I just realized that my dog got out of the gate. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? Bro, my dog. It was, yeah, my dog got out of the gate. And I just realized that he was, he, he, he was at the just out of the neighborhood. And man, I had to chase after my dog. He, he basically ran to my other friend's house. Like, so far away, like at the very back of the neighborhood. I have to go there. And believe me, I was running so fast. I don't know why, because I don't run fast. So I was surprised. So you know what? Maybe this coffee is good after all. I mean, I don't know. It's bad. It's good at the same time. But I am not drinking another BTS coffee in my entire life. Ever again. Because it turns me insane. It's like I was sniffing marijuana. <laughs> I will gag it. I am not buying this ever again. It made me go insane. Okay. Last night I was, uh, because of this, I was singing twice songs, BTS songs. I went insane. I was watching Coco Melon and shit. And I actually enjoyed Coco Melon. I mean, Coco Melon is always entertaining. But the thing is, I haven't listened to BTS for like how many years? Like, it's been so long. And when I played one BTS song, bitch, I remember what it is. I don't know why. I, I haven't listened to it since I was like, I don't know, six. Whatever. But, but this coffee is drugs, man. This coffee did some shit to me. I don't know what it did to me. It's drugs to me, man. Uh, it fell under my bed and I'm lazy to get it. But it's drugs. To me, I am never drinking it ever again, and I have no sleep, and I'm fucking tired. So, after singing random K-pop twice songs and BTS songs and watching Coco Melon, I went on to Netflix, <laughs> and I started watching this fucking Korean documentary about Telegram people uh, doing porno child pornography crime thingy. And Telegram. This is why I never download Telegram. Because I know shit happens. And so I was watching it. And it was pretty boring. And I, I was on live to. I don't have Telegram. Shut up. Sorry. I, don't shut up. I'm sorry. I'm just very interested to that. Anyways. But yeah. Um, <coughs> it was pretty boring for me. Because I didn't like it. I felt uncomfortable while watching it. So I looked at my cam laptop cam and I took where's my tacket? These these blue things, these these tackets, these, these are like the ones that like these are sticky. You can use this to like stick stuff in your wall. That's what I'm using for my posters. Why the fuck does my poster look like that? But anyways, um yeah, so I put this in my laptop cam because I don't have because I lost the don't don't ask i keep losing shit but 
I covered my, and I felt so uncomfortable at three. No, it was four a.m. Actually, sorry, at four a.m. Something something. While I was watching it, um, so, and then I started looking at my window and at my door, and bro, I swear my anxiety was almost acted up in front of two hundred people watching me because I got scared and you know shit started happening. So I kept checking my door. I kept looking at my windows, and one of my windows here, the lock broke. Because practically I broke it because um don't ask why it's a long story. My family was having a fight, so I don't know why I broke my window. There's an explanation why I broke my windows, my lock window, and I kept looking at it while watching the Korean documentary about telegrams. Like there's this one guy named. I forgot his name, but he's like the mastermind of all the shit. Uh, and he basically tricks twelve-year-olds to send him nudes, and it made me really uncomfortable. Someone's starting to text me. It's seven a.m. in the morning. I th- I didn't know my friends would wake up this early. And my sister said that people go to Robinson's later, but I don't want to go because I feel uncomfortable now. I don't feel safe out anymore because after I watched that Korean documentary.